adapted for the lower class, middle class, or even the middle high class. Taxes will not be affected. We will get all the money, 100% of the money, from fees and, and taxes on Wall Street and Big Bang. You will not have more taxes. I assure you that you will not. However, you will get free you will get free college and just benefits. Doesn't that sound great? Doesn't it? No increasing taxes at all. No increasing taxes at all. Actually, we could decrease taxes because of this. When more people have enough money to pay for taxes, when more people are in that middle class range, more people are paying taxes. And when there are more people contributing to paying taxes, each person will have to pay le the less, each person will have to pay less from their personal pocket. Think of it this way. Uh, 10 friends go and reserve a shelter in a park. The shelter reservation costs $100 a, uh, an, an hour. Each person, because there are 10 people, each person will pay $10. But if there are only two people reserving the shelter, each person will have to pay $50. The more people there are paying, the less each person needs to pay. Free college will decrease taxes and not increase them. My opponent stated that nine that Bill Gates and Steve Jobs took a risk when dropping out of college. But what happens if you do take that risk and you don't get anything for you? You probably just go to McDonald's and just work there. And what happens when you give college to the poor for free? Yeah, there's gonna be way more uh, numbers. And most likely college education levels would go down. And people would have the same degrees and try going to the same places. Yet <coughs> one person that got C's and D's and one person got, that got A's and even more A's, they would have the same opportunity at the same job and it would just look all the same. Free college is to your benefit. Why are you going against it why are you going against your benefits? I strongly, I strongly recommend that you know what you benefit from and what your interests are before you argue against them. Those with, free, with college degrees tend to have higher earnings, better health, and even longer lives. Society as a whole will benefit from higher education, from will benefit from higher graduation rates since the dependence on government will decrease. Also, education should be a right to all people and not a privilege to the wealthy, like it currently is. In order, in order to this, for this to really change, state colleges and universities tuition should be free. I find it beyond disturbing and confusing that people are against free college when free college do so much good to America in general. Tuition free college will do a lot of things, such as surely making education opportunities equal to all. And, uh, and each and every person will have a good, will have a equal opportunity to, for a good and successful life. Also, Free college would diminish student loan debt and their results create a better and stronger economy. And at the same time, people will become at ease from the stress that their student loans are putting on them. Free college is possible and is affordable. It will not require a lot of money, but it will result in a lot of benefits. 
I find it disturbing and scary when you are defending the things that are truly against you. We are now living in a society in which your station in life is largely determined by that of your parents. And this is unfair to the children, for they should have the same and equal opportunities to live a successful and good life, and making college free will be the first step in the right direction. Thank you. So, all in all, free college would allow students to take free college less serious, make the $18.2 trillion of debt, and increase that, and make the taxes from 6 to 7% to a way bigger number to pay off the $70 billion a year. And if you give free college to everyone, you're going to have a heck of a time looking for a job. <laughs>